So back in 2014, um, we were approached uh, by Rapa Nui authorities to see whether we would consider. We were clearly in some uh, earthquake recovery uh, strife at that time, but we've worked assiduously since then to move this forward as fast as, as, as is possible, and it's come to a really great conclusion today. Well, it's not the conclusion, it is the beginning of the next step, but the bonds are tied now and the tipuna are ready to to travel home. And what some of that work involves, um, I suppose, getting here today, obviously there'll be quite a lot of communication between representatives from Rapa Nui and, um, and the Canterbury Museum and across um, New Zealand. Sure. So the, the big the big thing is the agreement to do it. That is the really the most important thing. The rest of it is just logistics and organisation and there's a lot of it and it's very detailed. But having made the, the decision and the right decision, everybody has come together and worked unbelievably cooperatively. Do you think this is the start of a sort of new partnership or new relationship between New Zealand and Rapa Nui? I sincerely hope so. Um, certainly the bonds, the, the gifts they've given us are, are hugely appreciated and they are hugely appreciative of the fact that we are repatriating the tipuna. Do you have